Good morning, how are you? Welcome to the Positive Habit Anxiety Free, Stress Free. I would like to stress that when I say anxiety free or stress free, what I really mean is unnecessary anxiety or unnecessary stress. Um, because we do suffer with so much unnecessary chronic anxiety that has really very little to do with what we need in terms of you know, a healthy level of anxiety for our survival. Um, so of course, it's not completely free or wanting to get rid of something, but it is about being very clear on, is this actually a, a sort of, is this fear necessary? I think it's a really good question to ask yourself. Anyway, that's by the by. I am here this week to continue on with our work on the best self, on your best self. And last week I shared a poem that my son Luca had written for Mother's Day and in it he apologised and I just thought I would highlight this because it's something that I see so often, um, not just with Luca um, but mainly with my clients who will continually apologise for things that they have really nothing to be sorry for. Um, and it's a behavior I think that's worth noting and looking at. Is it something that you're doing too much maybe, where you'll find yourself just constantly saying, oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, sorry, sorry. And if you are, why? Because quite often, you know, you're just like maybe, I don't know, you, you sort of sat down too quickly or opened a door or whatever it may be. There's, there's really no merit for this constant apologizing because what it does is it actually has a really negative uh, impact on your self-esteem. And self-esteem is so linked into our ability to let our best selves shine brightly, to feel comfortable, to feel confident, to be able to allow the best of us to come out into the world every day. So this week, I want you to just simply notice, examine, am I apologizing too much? And if so, can I just hold back? Can I what um, David G, who I did some lovely meditation training with recently, calls a pattern interrupt. So in terms of whether it's a behavior, in terms of maybe emotional eating or, uh, you know, getting annoyed, getting angry, an emotional behavior, it could be either. It's that idea of literally just stopping the pattern, interrupting the pattern. So if you are about to apologize, it's the awareness of that, that you can hear the words almost coming out. I'm so. And we're back to the breath. So you can take a deep breath in and then a slow exhale out. And you can literally just curb that behavior right at the, at the point before you delve in. So awareness is as always just the most essential agreement ingredient. So thank you so much for watching. Thanks again for all the positive feedback. The Positive Habit book is doing so well and I'm just thrilled with all of your lovely emails. Thanks a million and I shall talk to you next week. Bye.